Hey Tube, it's Mark here, just going to bring you a short video, um, just going to bring you a review of a new local church Bible publisher's Bible that I've uh, recently received here. I just wanted to quickly share with you uh, my scripture behind me. Uh, I've got another couple of these posters uh, delivered to me recently. The one over this side here uh, is John 3.16. And the one uh, just next to the cross over there is 2 Timothy 3.16. I love both these verses. I love being surrounded like this. I've got the word on the wall. It's right next to me. Um, and I just love that. You can just step straight in this room and there's the word. And I, I have the cross there. And I just love it. I just can't get enough of the word. I love the word. And what better way to get the word than in the compact wide margin 130 series local church bible publishers bible which i have here and uh you have to forgive me on the light here guys it's very late here but i'm very excited i've just come back from a, a great excellent bible study king james bible believing bible study really great really edifying only just returned instantly put up the scripture instantly got out my my new bible and wanted to just quickly record a video for you guys um so here it is the um the 130 wide margin compact uh, Bible. You can get this for 15, 15 pounds. I think if I just quickly check out the price, that's $25 US. Um, if you're in the UK, I would recommend that you buy uh, maybe one or two other Bibles um, just to offset the shipping. It can be quite expensive if you're in the UK or anywhere else. In the States, you can just order this and pay almost a nominal fee. And for twenty five dollars, it's just, it's just ridiculous. It's again, it's like uh, the three five five that I have here. It's a beautiful, beautiful Bible. Uh, you'd just be crazy not to get it. It's just fantastic, and I, I love to support the local church Bible publishers. Uh, they're in Lansing, Michigan. I'm in the UK. Happy to support them. Very, very happy to recommend them. I believe personally that the best Bibles on the market. Um, I'm going to show you. Um, what this looks like uh, in brief and again just apologies for the light it's quite dark but hopefully you can get an idea of the size I'm a regular size guy so you can see my hand there it fits perfectly in your sort of jacket pocket your inside pocket or your, your lower outside pocket to give you an idea of scale and size I have an iPhone here and you can see just there that it's uh, it's very small it's very, very small. And again, compared to the 355, if you have this already, which you may or may not do, just to give you an idea, it just, you know, it's a good, it's a good reasonable size. But again, you can see the clearest difference, sorry, <laughs> uh, just in the width alone. And this has the Old and New Testament, but obviously this, uh, the wording on this is just, it's just a joy to read. Now, the real question is, what's this like? Uh, and I'll just open a sample page for you, just to give you an idea. Now, this has margin, uh, wide margin, for notes in a, in a compact Bible. So as you can see straight away, small Bible just just sits in the hand. Just sits in the hand, not a problem. Um, and it's, uh, it's, I mean, even at the, the end of it, it just sits in the hand. For a compact Bible, it's absolutely fantastic. Cover is top grain cowhide. And, it, and, you know, the normal test that people do, this little rolling thing, you know, brand new Bible just flips back. Very soft, very soft, very supple. Brand new Bible, but the pages don't stick together like some of these other horrible Bibles that are on the market. But just to show you um, uh, how this wide margin looks like, I've got a couple of post-it notes in here already. Um, just to show you uh, sort of what it looks like and with maybe a post-it. I haven't written any notes in it yet. I've literally had it a day or two. But hopefully, I hope you can see this okay in the light. So you can see the post-it note at the top there. The text obviously is very small. But again, hopefully if I can get a little closer, just to give you an idea. But it's very, very readable. I mean, uh, you know, it depends on your eyesight, really. If you're... Uh, what do they call it? Shorts, alongsighted. And you, you might have a problem with this, maybe. Um, but for your average eyes, I mean, I wear glasses, not for reading because I'm uh, short sighted. Um, and it's perfectly readable for me. Uh, I don't know about other people, but it is very small font. Um, so if that's hard for you to read, um, I, I probably wouldn't recommend it on that basis. But it's still a great Bible. As I said, look at this. I mean, it's just so thin. I mean, again, 
take the profile of a of a of an iPhone. You can see that it's at least I hope you can see. Try and angle that right. I mean, it's not much wider than an iPhone, and not much bigger necessarily. It's almost like um, some of those bigger sort of Samsung phones or the smaller tablets. It's it's you know it's just so easy just to slot around. I take it down with me uh, today at lunch. I had a a great opportunity just to take it with me to lunch. I could eat my lunch and I could listen to some preaching and I've got this in front of me. And it is easier than taking this around with me. I don't have any problems carrying this around with me at work or anything. But this is so much more practical. And this is the thing. I mean, you can have a Bible or a couple of Bibles. But I mean, I've got quite a few now. I've got five or six of them. And it's weird. Um, they each have a different purpose. Um, and I, I certainly plan to buy more, uh, at least to give away to people. Um, but this is, I love this already. It's so great. It's so cool. As I said, it just flops right open. And what I also like about this is it's a very uh, straightforward Bible. And by that, I mean, there's none of this birth, marriages and deaths thing at the front. Uh, I mean, it's, I don't have a massive problem with that, but I do in every single Bible. It's just a bit, you know, a little bit irritating. It's okay. Uh, this doesn't have any maps. What this does have, it just goes bang straight into Genesis uh, there's a, a small section at the beginning, uh, which is a list of words with their pronunciation. You've got the introduction, I believe, from the translators here. But a bunch of of just, like, plain pages, so you've got room to write notes in it. I can imagine this would be a fantastic, and not imagine, I'm sure it is, a great soul-winning Bible. This is the Bible that's going to come with me uh, when I travel overseas. I'm planning to go to the Philippines in the next month or two. I'm taking this with me because uh, I'm going to go to church a couple of times there. There's two great King James uh, Bible-believing um, churches that, are, that I go to when I'm there. Uh, I'm taking this with me and this is going to come with me when I uh, uh, witness to a couple of people that my wife wants me to speak to. So I'm excited about it. And this is a perfect Bible for that job. Uh, this would be perfect for a missionary. It's perfect for a traveller. Uh, it's just a fantastic little Bible. Um, uh, I can't remember if I said this or not. The price of this, twenty five dollars in the UK. That's fifteen pounds. Um, if you're in the states, uh, for local church Bible publishers, I don't believe that you pay any shipping, or if you do, it's very nominal. In the UK, it's a little bit pricey to be honest with you. So I would recommend if you're going to order one of these, you ideally want to order it, you know, with two or three perhaps, uh, just to offset the cost of the postage. It's quite expensive, but this is a great Bible. I would just pay to have one of these. In fact, I only paid, uh, you know, to get this, the 355 uh, and postage. I didn't care because it's a great Bible. It's worth double the figure at least. You know, it's ridiculous how the quality of these Bibles, uh, local church Bible publishers, easily the most recommended uh, Bible from me personally. And again, I'm not somebody to to necessarily get that sort of advice from but uh, I love the quality of local church bible publishers I believe them to be the best um, uh, fabricators of these of these books in the world personally you know it's a big thing to say but it just is they're just and I have several of them now <laughs> just beautiful they're so well made you will simply not regret it so uh, yeah so the compact wide margin 130 uh, 15 pounds UK, 25 dollars US, um, easily worth the shipping. I mean, it's just, it's just crazy. Um, so, yeah, so recommended guys. I'll put a link into the um, uh, the page if you want to order it. I don't get any commission or anything like that. I wouldn't want to anyway. I just, I would happily recommend this all day, every day to everybody. So beautiful Bible, plenty of room for notes. I'm looking forward to turning this into the Bible that I use to witness with and the Bible that I use to, to talk to people about the salvation plan uh, through our Lord Jesus Christ. Um, and um, yeah, I, I thoroughly recommend it. So uh, just wanted, as soon as I could, I couldn't do it yesterday, but as soon as I was able to, I got back here, scripture went up, grabbed the Bible, wanted to record a quick video before I go to sleep. Um, really recommended, um, strongly recommended guys. So Thanks very much for watching. Take care. God bless.